He is the gin foil chef, a man with a video love. Hey YouTube, how's it going? Well, today I am here to talk about an ending and a beginning. The ending in question has to do with this coffee carafe from my coffee pot. You will notice right here there is a hole at the bottom edge of this thing. I bumped it on the sink when I was rinsing it out and then a few seconds later I was noticed that as I was trying to fill it, it wasn't filling. And it's because the water was pouring out as fast as I could pour it in. So the coffee pot, the, the, this, this particular carafe is dead. However, fortunately, when I bought this latest coffee maker, it's the exact same make and model as the previous one I had. And when I got rid of the old coffee maker because it was dead, I saved the carafe. And so I have gotten it out, cleaned it up, and put it into service. So that's good, but it's a hairy moment when your coffee carafe breaks like that and you can't make coffee and there's no way you can buy a new thing. So it's a good thing I saved the old one. Okay, that's the end. That is the ending to talk about. Now, there is a beginning. And it has to do with this nostalgia thing I was talking about yesterday. Well, something I did, as a matter of fact, I did it twice. And I'm going to do it again. And that has to do with what astute viewers may have noticed in the title of this video. The designation YTO3-1-364. YTO3, that's YouTube Orbit. And the three designate this would be my third orbit. Yeah, I'm going to do that again. The 1 365 means this is video one, the, well, the 1 364. This is video number one, and there are 364 to go. And the idea behind the YouTube orbit, something that Uncle Knox created some few years ago and then uh, a bunch of other people got in on it and Ergo got into it and he started doing a bunch of uh, kind of support semi almost organization thing with it. He had a YouTube channel for it, and there was a website for it and so on. You know, I got curious. I was doing some looking up last night after that video and some more this morning. And as far as I can tell, I don't think anybody's currently doing the YouTube orbit right now. Uh, I haven't found anything more recent than two years old. So, anyway, I've decided on my own I'm going to do a YouTube orbit. That's one orbit of the Earth around the Sun, 365 days, each day being a video. One video every day for a year. 365 consecutive daily videos. Yeah. It's an exercise in discipline. It gets me back into doing daily videos hardcore the way I used to do them. And so I'm going for it. 365 consecutive videos starting with this one. And now for the invitation slash challenge. You think you're up for it? Let's go. The only requirement is that you do it. There's no real major rules or anything like that. Anybody can do it. And, uh, you know, you keep track of your video count yourself. And I'm doing it like that with the YTO 1-whatever or 1-364, 2-363, and so on on down the line until I get to 365-0. Anyway, that's what's going on. That's what I'm starting. Anybody care to join? Let's get some orbit going on. Thanks for watching. Take it easy. I'm out of here. Mr. Chen for